Right then, welcome back. Uh, race four of four, a Laguna, a Laguna Seca. Not a massive fan. Uh, 2008 Kawasaki, this is the last one. We'll have a look at the setup and we'll do some, uh, we'll do some pros and cons once we have finished now we made some tweaks last time out at vir south i wasn't particularly happy with them i thought that they potentially made the bike a little bit less engaging to use it was certainly faster much faster uh so we'll see how we go on laguna it's Night time as well, which brings its own compromises with regards to ambient temperature and tyre heat. So we've got medium soft and yeah, we'll go from there. It's always a crash fest. Dear me. I like the look of that. Super veloce, veloce, what we're calling it. I guess it's Italian. Trim levels on Alfa Romeo's veloce, isn't it? I mean, to me, it should be a Veloce, but I'm happy to go whatever people want. Or swing against the tide and annoy everybody, because that seems to be, seems to be what people want to do. Right, well, we've definitely got the legs on this Ducati, even if they do want to park it in the way. Go on, mate, back up the inside. There you go. That's it. Run wide, though. sound like it's revving particularly cleanly, does it? Right, what are we chasing down? Is it a Suzuki or a Honda? I think it's got a swing-on mounted plate, so that would make it either a CB or an MV. I don't think there's any... Oh, Katana, possibly. Katana got a swing-on mount plate? I can't remember. Tire good, rear tire scrap. But they're both soft, so we can't really do anything. Don't lift the front end over there again. All the way down to first. So patient on the gas. Well, we've got to close up this bit and try Just try and set them up to our break them up over the top into the corkscrew it's a Honda it's my Honda that's the exact same bike that I've set in the garage right now mine's a bit better looking though Second for a bit more drive. Little bit of a lead, second. Way too deep into there. Way too deep, Captain. as well don't get on the outside curve that's exactly what we did that curve drops off on the outside and it just rips you off the bike it's a hateful bit of curve that's on the limit for the brake sliding and skating into there we've got a bit of a cut 
No time penalty, which I'm surprised about. Mind you, we're not exactly setting the fastest lap, so it doesn't really matter. Come on. Well, it was fairly easy in the end, but it wasn't particularly enjoyable. I will not lie. So, 123.150, I've made a note of that, I'll sort the replay and I will see you in a couple of seconds for a time attack. So, time attack, we did a 123 point... Well, not that fast. A 123.150. Oh my god. I'll see you in a minute. Now... I can't really go any further than 408th because it crashes. It says there was a problem retrieving the leaderboard information or something. So we'll go for 122.950 as the target. Now, it is possibly not an accurate reflection of what we're going to do, but I would like to think we can go... An error occurred while retrieving the ghost. I've never had that before. Um, I'd like to think we can go two seconds quicker at the very least. Um, if we go to the... No ghost select... Oh, God almighty. 123.150. Exactly the same time as we did with that. So we have no ghost to attack. Okay, fair enough. Select tyres. We've got to go soft, soft, surely. Uh, and we'll have a go once the tyres are warmed up. Wide through there again. Don't go on that outside curb, thank you. One twenty two four, that is better. Yeah, that front tire. So we'll leave that as it is, 122.416. We'll go and get a time off the boards. Oh God, it's going to take about a month. What was it? 122.416. Didn't write it down, did I? I mean, that is still deep, isn't it? 311th. Crikey. So we'll go for that, 310. Medium front, soft rear. Yeah, we'll... We'll go for medium front, soft rear. I don't know how much time's left in this bike. We might get into the 21s. Just. Well, we weren't far off, were we, to say... It was a bit of an exploration, that first lap. Nicer. Oh, we're 7,000 down. Did not expect that. That first section felt much better. Still 7,000. Right, let's try and run third up here. Oh, we are not getting that any better. into the last corner. It shouldn't really affect us. Ah, oh, no 5 -0. Do you know what? I'm just going to go around and push and push and push and push and it's just not going to get any better. Ah, dear me. What do we get? 122.050. I mean, he's going to be so far down the leaderboards. But again, that was always going to be the case. A V4, V-twin, anything with a lot of grunt. I mean, the sub-surprise of the Super Naked is not actually on there a lot more than 
than it is because that thing just fires out of corners. So I would have put 254th again. It's just getting annihilated, isn't it? There's just thousand cc bikes everywhere. Absolutely everywhere. So setup wise then, that's where we are. We used anti wheelie two to launch one slash two in the races engine braking three no traction um pros and cons it, it's fast for a 600 it is i mean the, yeah the rating's high at 820 whatever it is 821 826 um it can hold its own against thousands but ultimately it struggles because it doesn't have the grunt it doesn't have the torque it has the power it just doesn't have the torque um, and it's got a good front end but there's a caveat to that and that is just dependent on the tire cons the rating is too high. A 600cc bike should not be swimming about in 800s. Milestone, hopefully, for Ride 5, they've adjusted it. The top spec 600 fully tuned sits at 799. That is where it should be for me, and every bike feeds off of that, so you can use a slightly detuned 1000, or a slightly or not as tuned 1000 and, and bits and bobs and just muck about with it. Um, it's got low top speed because it's in the wrong class, a gear choice is critical it's a 600 it doesn't make any torque um if you've ridden any motorbikes before you know 600s in sixth you pull the throttle back and nothing happens you have to go down three four gears before you'll get any decent forward drive um outside of that I, I, it's done better than i thought i did not think it would be this quick i didn't think it would be this nice a bike to use um it's genuinely shocked me with the pace that it has uh, I'm not a fan of the looks. It's a little bit halfway between a Ninja and a Hayabusa with the underseat pipe. They obviously tried to copy Honda. Honda were doing it with the CBR 600. I prefer a bit of a side pipe. I don't mind a bum warmer, but I think I prefer the side pipes. The styling's a bit a bit blamongy for me. Um, it's almost like a, a modern day jelly mold, isn't it? I think the later ZX6Rs are much better than 2014 onwards. Uh, but beauty's in the eye of the beholder if you like it mega they're a quick bike they're nice to use they're actually really well made for a, a kawasaki as well they don't tend to go rotten quite as fast as they used to um, and that's it um i hope you've enjoyed it uh, we'll do another one uh on a new bike next i think we're gonna do the 2016 mv brutal brutal and um, mv brutali 1090 rr so it's the road bike version of the race bike that we did previously and we're going to do the uh usa one naked 1000 cc trophy um so again it's similar i mean laguna Seca is in there vir north utah outer road america full so again it's just the us tracks isn't it but there's still the other videos coming as well with the other bikes that we're already doing so we'll get the brutalion on because it's a road bike and we'll have a bit of a muck about and uh, see how we get on but that's it uh, thanks for watching commenting liking subscribing all the usual jazz and fingers crossed i will see you next time take care stay safe peace there's the crash fest she had a real protest. Ah, oh, we've binned it. I just clipped that inside curb. We're not actually any worse off than when we got a decent start last time. Always going to happen. I mean, look at that. They're still turning. Right, we've got to change that tyre. What we're chasing their way. One's definitely a Honda. We've made a mess of this. Yeah, we've definitely made a mess of that. Oh, she's had an absolute nightmare over there. Wow, we've gone to the moon.